Ibrahim, today topic is a differential equations, okay? And I'm discussing one question, June 2004, paper 3, and what the whole story may have given dy over dx given by an examiner, and this whole thing given. And we have given some values, these are called initial values. Some teachers say this is called initial values. Initial. Some books you can find it word initial values, okay? So we have to make y subject, okay? So let's start how we can make y subject. There are a few steps. So step number one, separation of variables. Separation of variables. So cross multiply. Y square comes here. And this dx goes on the other side. Like this. Okay, done. But up till now, no separation, okay? So <clears throat> because my subject is y, so I will bring the whole thing down. So y to power 2 over y to power 3 plus 1 dy equal to dx. You can see all y on the left hand side and all x on the right hand side. This first step, this is called step number 1, separation of the variables. Okay? Keep your eye one thing, especially when what is subject? What is subject? Bring on the left hand side. Okay? And I just explain after this step number two, I'm going to do, and that is integration both sides. Integrating both sides. So integrating both sides, so let's see what happens then. So when integrate left side, I will get this kind of thing and this kind of thing. Okay. After this, I taught you one rule of integration. I repeat again for the rule of integration. Rule is, let me discuss here, the rule is a function in the denominator and its derivative in the numerator and the power is 1. So answer is a logarithm of function. This is a formula we have, plus c. Example, I have here 3x plus 1 dx. What is derivative? Naturally 3. This 0, this 3. I have 3. And what a whole power? 1. So what is answer logarithm of 3x plus 1? And this C, 3 automatically eliminates. So same story I am going to apply here. So let's see. This function is down and derivative up. What is derivative 1 is 0. So no need. What about this derivative? All of you know power comes down and power 1 less. So we need 3y square. But problem, I have only y square. What is lackness here? 3 is required. So what I'm going to do, multiplying 3, like 3 multiplying 3 dividing. You know very well it has no effect on the algebraic, no trouble at all. Okay. The upper 3, I brought inside. Right? It's very, very clear. Reason, I need the derivative down, function down, derivative up. So can I apply the same rule here? Why not? So 1 by 3 as it is, logarithm of function. This is my answer on the left hand side. And what is integration of 1? All of you know x. And c is compulsory. Call it equation number 1. I repeat again, what is the story here? Functions down, derivative up, so logarithm of function. And this 3 automatically eliminates. Same story here. Functions down, correct. Derivative up, okay. Power is 1, yes. Logarithm of function and this derivative automatically eliminates. It's okay. Now I use this initial values. So use the values. Okay, put x is equal to 0 and y equal to 1. When I put y1 here, so 1 by 3 logarithm, 1 to power 3, so y is 1, so 1 to power 3 is 1 plus 1, 2. And this 0, I'm going to keep here. C value is 1 by 3 logarithm of 2. I am put this value putting in number 1, put in 1. So when I put it here, 1 by 3 logarithm of y cube plus 1 equal to x and c value is this one I am writing as it is. So this is c value. Okay. Uh, my target is y, so y is my subject, I have to make it. But this, this, this 3 is disturbing to me. So multiply whole equation by 3. Multiply by 3. So multiply here 3, cancel, I get logarithm y cube plus 1. Multiply here 3, I get this. Multiply here 3, it's cancel. Okay. Now we have a logarithm. You must be good in logarithm after onward. Okay. I want to cancel logarithm, but rule is what? 
uh, a cancellation only possible if I have both side logarithm available. So log log cancel. Problem log is here, log is here, but log is not here. I have to eliminate this number and convert into logarithm. I oftenly explain my students this idea. For example, I think you know it that any number, for example, 3x. Can I write 3x, 3x into 1? Yes, I know. And what is 1? I, you know the rule. Uh, ln e is 1. All of you know ln e is 1. ln e is equal to 1. I can bring the whole value in the power. So can I say ln e to power 3x? Exactly. So here, this number, this log, copy. This logarithm, copy. But this number is without logarithm. So write ln e to power 3x. So I use the same concept here. Okay. Now, because the plus sign logarithm property says when add two logs in the middle plus, so these numbers always multiply. So 2 e to power 3x and logarithm y cube plus 1 and log log cancel from both end. y cube plus 1 equal to 2e cube 3x and this one goes on other end look like this and y cube and take cube root and this is my final answer so this is a whole story you can see so ultimate my target was to find out the uh, y subject okay if you differentiate if you derivative differentiate you get the same thing again okay so no need to do actually what is the whole process when you have a given uh, different derivative given we have to make equations the whole story okay like applause